seeing Josh go down like that? I mean, uh, it's kind of hard to explain the feeling. It hurts because you've seen how hard he worked all offseason, and everybody was thinking, like, this is going to be his year. But he went down, so minor setback for a major comeback. So he just got to keep his head on right, and he'll be okay. How do you guys kind of support him through that? I know he said that, you know, being out last year was hard on him. How do, how do you guys kind of help him through this? Uh, we just, anything he needs, just let him know that if he needs anything, we're all here for him and that he's not alone in this. So he just needs to keep his head up and we're, we're there for him every step of the way. Are you hoping you're in the mix to kind of fill in that spot? Yeah, I hope so, but we'll see. Game week's coming up. Still got a couple more camp practices left, so we'll see how it unfolds. From when you saw it happen during practice, did you know it was something really bad, or like what was kind of your first? I mean, first off, seeing him lay down, you know it's bad because he's never one of those guys. If something hurts, he won't just lay down. He'll get up and walk it off. But seeing that he couldn't get up and walk it off and hear him scream, like we knew it was bad from from as soon as he fell. Did, did, uh, did uh, somebody run into him, or I don't even play? really know. I don't even really know how it happened because I didn't want to watch it on film. I don't like seeing stuff like that, so I just I didn't look at it. But it, I'm pretty sure it was bad. Was yesterday your first uh, time working with the inside linebackers? I know you've been outside yep. since spring. Yeah, that was my first time. How is the transition going? Had you already kind of prepared, like just mentally knowing what that position does? Or Yeah, uh, being outside, knowing what the outside backers and the D-line D are doing in certain defenses help makes my job easier, m makes my job back in the inside easier. So just knowing what everybody else is doing around me makes my job easier. I just need to get more familiar with the playbook at that spot. You talk to your brother a little bit about it? Yeah, we, we go over it every night as soon as we get home. We'll watch film and go over the playbook. How much has he helped you just with everything about your career so far? A lot, because we compete. Me and we both just compete, and we've always been side by side since we were little kids. So ever since freshman year high school, when we were first on the same team, we just clicked and never stopped since then. How much older is he than you? He's 10 months older than me. Okay, but you're the same Same grade. class. Okay, yes, always sir. been in the same grade growing up? Yes. How, how do you think kind of the defense will look without without Josh? He was such a big leader and obviously one of the few seniors you guys even have on Oh, we're going to need some of, uh, like, Chris Barnes. We're going to need guys like him to step up, Nate Matters. We just need more captains in the defense to step up, uh, Darius Pickett, those kind of guys. But really, we need everybody to step up in the defense, and I think we'll be okay. Have you talked to Josh in the past few days? Yeah. yeah. How's he doing, do you think? He's doing better now. Now that uh, it was uh, the first day or two was bad, but he's back being, like, happy. So I'm just there for him. Did he say he's going to try to come back next year? I'm not sure yet. I haven't okay. talked to him about none of that yet. Awesome.